Hey, Don here. Okay, so I'm trying out a new camera app because uh, it might just work with my Bluetooth headset. Uh, it's supposed to work with Bluetooth mics. Camera FV5 Lite, and this is one of those part of it works, you know, for free, and then they want you to pay to for the rest of it to work. And it already I already see that the my phone will. Uh, normally does like 1920 by 1080 or something well it'll only let you do uh, 12 something whatever uh, for the free version so that's the negative right there and uh, I haven't I'm fixing I thought I'd try you know just a regular video first before I tried the uh, Bluetooth headset and uh, see how that you know compares and uh, it does have uh, some interesting adjustments and it's the interface is easy to tell what you're doing you know but uh, I'm gonna move it on out a bit closer to the screen and uh, see if the sound changes much you're supposed to be able to adjust the sound input volume you're supposed to be able to do most of this stuff while you're shooting the video and uh, let's see I think I see the sound input volume I see something I'm touching it, but it doesn't, it's not doing anything. So I guess not. The lighting can change. That could be useful, like when I'm doing something like this, it's really bright. I don't see it changing, though. It changed when I did it before I started recording, so maybe it only works while you're recording. There's a menu button. Oh, I don't know what it means. It looks like mountains and a a uh, pound sign or a number sign, and then something looks sort of like a monitor. I don't know what they are. I'll hit them and see. Didn't seem to do anything to my preview anyway. Oh, there it is. Made some color stuff show up. So I oh, I guess that's your color adjustments. Now I'm changing to the pound sign. Oh, now I've got a grid on there. Oh, okay. This is stuff that you can see on the screen. I would just give the, the uh, phone too much to do. <laughs> oh, I see. You turn them on or off. And I wouldn't really want to mess with the colors in the middle of the video anyway. I mean, you could, but... The other one... I don't know. Maybe you can adjust the size. Yeah. Or maybe that's just showing you what you're actually getting. I think maybe that's what it's doing. Yeah, because this is 720 instead of 1080, so I'm not getting my full screen. Well, it's not 720p. Well, yeah, I think it is. So the 1080p. Yeah, I think that's getting my full. I'm pulling it up right up to my face now because I have to. But it looks like now that would get me my whole monitor. And before I wasn't getting it. I was holding it out there like I normally do you know because uh but what it does is it makes what it looks like what it's doing is it makes what you're not getting shadowy you can still see it on the phone but you're just shadowy so i think that's what it is so that you'd really want to use that so you know what you're getting and then there's awv automatic light balance af automatic focus and the next one i forgot it's just squares and stuff iso uh, plus or minus something Uh, since you keep touching yeah you touch them for four, very four times and, and shake the whole phone before you get it to come up and do anything exposure compensation okay uh, so I don't really want to change any of that lighting metering mode oh okay I believe it's on I would want it on automatic most of the time I, I, you know it's best when you you're moving the phone around, you know, at different things, and if it changes for you automatically, then that's good. But if you have it set, I mean, if you're really trying to do some de detailed or artistic work or something, you know, and you know, and you know, actually, you know, I just know probably just enough to get in trouble with the setting some of that stuff. So, and the thing is, I can forget, you know. Uh, I would forget to change the stuff because I just, you know as I was shooting so I'd really rather do it for me automatically and I can tell that it, it looks like it has a real big delay 
uh, the, the, the screen keeps freezing as I move the camera and that's what happened with my the uh, built-in camera app that came with this Alcatel 845 phone and it would record that way so I got a feeling it's going to record that way and so that's useless if that's what it's doing but it's not but uh, and I don't have anything I didn't change anything from the default uh, yet so um, I want to try that uh, after I see what this turns out like I want to do see if I can record if I can record from my Bluetooth headset ear set is what it is one of the little one ear deals uh, this thing right here then uh, where are you then I may be able to uh, see if it show up a little better in a different background uh, then I might be able to uh, then I'll know it can be done and I'll find it you know I, I, I don't think I would want to really use this app because it doesn't do everything uh, but it won't it wouldn't record an open camera whoops and it does have external mic settings and stuff that but maybe it only meant for analog uh, you know why wi wire input external mic so uh, this makes it has a specific Bluetooth input so we'll see if it works all right